Here we go. All right, what's up, guys? I've been excited for this dive for a while. We're gonna go dive the Okaloosa County Pier. And we're gonna clean up all the stuff that's under here, a bunch of fishing line, fishing poles, maybe a couple of surprises, a couple, couple of treasures. So I'm pretty excited. I'm gonna go check in, get my dive gear on, and uh, we're gonna get in the water and get this place cleaned up before they open it up for the fishermen. And guys, while we're out here doing this pier cleanup, we also got Dan in the sand. He's about to uh, make a pretty sweet sand castle. What's going on, Dan? How are you? Good today. Just letting people know about you. That's, that's what I'm talking that's about. That's right. Man. Here's my little sand castle joy today. That's right. That's right. What are you building? You gonna do something? Uh, I'm gonna do classes. Classes? So oh, like you doing classes? People, yeah, oh, as people nice. kind of like just wander up, I'm gonna be like, you wanna play in the sand? And like just get people to play. So this will, you see how I do like a little circle? Yeah. I'll pretty much be putting the kids on the outside of it. I'll stay on the inside of it and just let them build little sand castles about that. Maybe that's cool. That's like, cool. Like, yeah. That's awesome. There's a toolkit up there. You could win for free, right? Oh, so you can like shoot. pick up trash and win the toolkit, right? There you go. Yeah, man. There you go. Awesome. All right, well, you guys uh, have fun down there. Yeah, oh yeah, it's gonna be great. I know. Appreciate it. I know, it's beautiful weather for it. All right, guys, we're back below the surface again. Check this little dude out. He's stuck on this hook. This is what you call ghost fishing. That's when this fishing line is down here and it has little hooks on it and the fish will get caught on it. And then once that fish dies, he'll fall off the hook and he'll catch another fish. And the story continues until somebody gets this stuff off the pier. But that's what we're here for today. Diving the Okaloosa Pier, clean it all up, all this trash, all this fishing line, and try to get it all out of here. This is the summer cleanup. They just had the spring cleanup earlier this year, so it was only a couple months ago, so that we didn't find a whole bunch of trash this time. But I think the distance between this cleanup and then next year's spring cleanup, we're gonna find a lot more trash. Just the way it goes. But you can see all this entanglement stuff all these hooks and lines and everything that just hangs down here to inadvertently catch some fish, sea turtles. Heck, even our fishing line while we're trying to fish, we even get hung up in our own stuff. It's a good day to come out here to pick up all this trash. Look at this beer cans, sunglasses, bait boxes. I actually found some pretty cool lures. I got a couple gotcha plugs off of here. I got a couple paddle tails all in really good condition so that was going in my toolbox those glasses were trash they uh i guess they've been sitting down there for a little while so unsalvageable but we got them out of there anyways now somebody the week prior to us coming out here lost their pier gaff so we were able to find that and retrieve it get that brought back up to its owner look at that little toy car or some little kid was pissed when he lost that thing. But it's pretty fun. Just a one tank dive. They do a safety brief in the morning and then everybody goes in, uses up all their gas in their tank while they're trying to clean up the pier. We come back in and then at the end, we get to jump off the end of the pier. So that's pretty cool. There's only a couple groups of people that actually could jump off the end of the pier the lifeguards when their training sessions is over and uh, the guys that come down here to clean it up. And if you guys stick around to the end, you'll see me jump off the end of the pier right on the back of a tiger shark. And that ain't even no far out tail. We seriously saw the shark swimming around. I thought that he was a little ways off when I jumped, but as soon as I jumped, he appeared to turn back in my direction. You can kind of see his silhouette as I'm falling 30 feet to the surface of the water. It's cool though, he didn't kill me, he didn't even care about me, he actually just turned and went the other way. Look at all these dead fish in here. This is exactly why that tiger shark was here. They come in here and they clean up all these dead little fish. It's a nice easy little snack for them. Here got some spade fish, that's cool. A couple of remoras. This dive was just the start of my weekend of diving. Right after I leave here, I go up to Vortex Springs, do a little dive up there in the cavern. And then the following day, I was out to Panama City to do a little boat diving. And lastly, check out this spiny lobster on the pier. 
Didn't even know they were up this close. Anyways, that's it. I'm going up. And of course, it's not a pier cleanup dive unless you're going to jump off the pier at the end. It's probably about a 30 foot drop. We're going to jump in. This is going to be fun. Hopefully you guys enjoyed the video. See you guys on the next one. He's like, he's like 20 feet down. Alright guys, that was awesome. We jumped off that pier. It was like 30 feet. That was a great time. I did that for you guys, so don't forget to hit the like button. We'll see you guys on the next one.